now, Real Estate Rundown with Arlo Nugent, presented by Blue Chip Realty Group. I'm Alex Steiniger. Our local real estate market was called red hot with homes practically selling themselves in hours. And I'm here with local real estate expert Arlo Nugent to help break this down. Arlo, it's so great to have you again. So is it really true that San Diego homes are, are selling like hotcakes? It's good to be back, Alex. And you know, they were for a long time. You would simply put a property on the market, multiple offers would come in. And that's why this misconception exists that people think you can just put a house on the market, you can find any real estate agent, whoever's willing to do it for the least amount of commission, and you're just gonna sit back, accept offers, sign it, escrow closes, and you celebrate. The reality, Alex, is that's simply not the way that it goes. Now, we're not seeing as many offers in this market now, but the important thing about that is when you accept the offer, there are so many legal implications after that that can directly impact the seller. They absolutely, and now more than ever, have to have a skilled agent in their corner to really articulate to them what those offers mean, what the implications are, and to be fighting for them. Well, and not just a skilled agent, but somebody who can give you a reality check on what the market really is doing. So knowing, knowing what you said, how does someone prioritize uh, what, what they need from an agent when they go to hire one? Right, so our market conditions change pretty frequently in San Diego, and it's really important that that person that's looking for a real estate agent does research. Two things they should look at. How many recent sales does, does that agent have? If they sold 10 homes last year, it simply doesn't matter now. Like you said, the agent should understand this market and be able to set the correct expectations with sellers. The second place they should look is for online reviews and find out what other people are saying about that agent. And do people typically interview multiple agents? You know, it really depends on how that person is introduced to the agent. A lot of my personal business happens to be referral, but I highly encourage that people interview at least two other agents just to make sure that they have the right person working with them. For a zero-pressure consultation from San Diego's real estate expert, Arlo Nugent, just go to soldbyarlo.com or call 866-337-1146.